this is Chris Gould and I want to give you one example of using the editing tools in the new Google Photos as opposed to a computer software such as Picasa. So in this example, uh, Jim and I are sitting on a sun-drenched beach and our faces look pretty dark. First of all, the horizon is crooked, so let me give that a little straighten. This is Picasa that I'm using right now. This is computer software. And I always do an I'm feeling lucky. That is Picasa's one-click autocorrect. So let's see if that does anything not a thing. And why is that? Because it has to do the same thing to the entire picture. And if it lightens our faces, it's going to make the background wash out, which is what will happen if I use fill light. So I increase fill light and our faces are now nice and visible, but the background is washed out. Now I'm going to take you to the same picture on a web browser using Google Photos. And this works the exact same way if you're using Google Photos app on an Android or an iPhone. So the pencil is the way to get into the editing tools. And watch this. One click on Auto. And our faces are brightened up and without washing out the sky. Hmm, can I straighten the horizon? Sure, with this crop and rotate tool. Then you just grab where it says zero and move it in either direction and you can line it up with the grid line. Click OK and you're done. I am very impressed with the auto, the easy way that Google Photos has given us to edit and doing an extra good job of it.